We begin tonight along the Crystal Coast where a 14-year-old boy is recovering from two shark bites. The teenager bitten while surfing Sunday in Atlantic Beach. WNTT's Bailey Martin is there live now with more on a scary situation. Bailey. That's right, Ken. The teenage boy was surfing in the waters here by the pier in Atlantic Beach when the unimaginable happened. He was bitten by a shark swimming through the cloudy waters. The boy wasn't able to see the shark because of water conditions. Yesterday, the water was pretty churned up. It was all kind of wind swell, so it was pretty rough. Um, it was hard to find really good sections to surf. Other surfers who were in the water at the time say sharks are common in the area, but they rarely bite. You see sharks around the pier quite a bit. Uh, you see them probably once or twice a week at least. And they just tend to leave us alone most of the time, especially if it's green water like it is today. They can see you and they just kind of leave you there, let you be. Atlantic Beach Fire Chief Adam Snyder says the town hasn't seen a shark bite in years. This doesn't happen very often. It happens approximately every three to five years. Uh, last one I recall uh, was three years ago down at Fort Macon State Park, and the individual was surfing also. And it was the same kind of conditions. The water was murky, uh, the waves were rough that day. Luckily, the boy was able to swim back to shore on his own and only has minor injuries. It was quite deep, uh, nothing major to where it's got into any bone or any, any uh, permanent damage. Uh, pretty much it was just kind of uh, superficial wounds to where it would just be able to uh, be stitched up and uh, healed up within the next few weeks. Beachgoers say this won't deter them from having a good time, but it will make them keep a close eye on their kids. I wasn't going to change my plans because we drove a long way just, you know, so he could go to beach. I'm just very cautious of how far he can go in, how long he's in, and just really keeping an eye on things. Officials say the boy was a local to Carteret County and familiar with beaches in the area. This is the first shark attack reported in our area this season. We'll continue to follow this story and bring you the latest details on WNCT.com. Live from Atlantic Beach, Bailey Martin, 9 on your side.